Hello everyone, my name is Gosha Makinan, an independent stamping app demonstrator. Today I have another wedding uh, favor uh, idea for you, which is tuck. Tuck for a small uh, bottle of wine. And look at that. It's time to celebrate. Uh, the bottles are empty. Guess why? <laughs> <laughs> joking right um, I put a bo uh, bottle uh, bottles actually I put the bottles um, last night to the cold water and I leave overnight and I just peel the tag very easily but if you want to leave the tag it's up to you so today the project is the tag and I will show you uh, another few which I made it Look at that! Ooh, so sweet, all. And another two. I'm using their uh, their um, new embossing folder, which gonna be available from the June first. And just uh, one more. Okay. But today that is the tutorial. If you would like to show me um, the another one project, please leave a comment um, just uh, next to the video. So right, okay, let's get started. Okay, we're gonna start from um, preparing the bottle. So uh, that is a 200 milliliters uh, wine bottle. I'm gonna use a label that is address label. So right, we're gonna stamp. I'm gonna use the uh, party with cake uh, stamp set, and I'm gonna use it is time to celebrate. And we're not gonna stamp with the cake. We're just gonna cover that. So okay, that is the stamp. I'm gonna use a sticker just to cover with the cake. And I'm using basic black stamp. Okay. And so I'm gonna cover that. Okay, I think it's ready. Peel off. And gonna stamp. See how it's working. I think it's okay. Yeah, perfect. I'm gonna peel now the take the bottle. I'm gonna peel the um, label and stick to my bottle. Okay, and it is time to celebrate. Right, we leave the bottle. Uh, the next thing we're gonna do. We're gonna make it a label. So I need a uh, whisper white cardstock measured two and a half inches by six and three quarter inches. Um, okay, and I score in a five. Okay, just need to burnish the line. And I'm using Smoky Slate ink pad and um, stamp set Blooming Love and I'm gonna use the little um, flower. Okay, and the Smoky Slate is uh, um, just a grey color. Take some and just stamp random oh um when you um stamp the flowers um will be will be better if you leave just a little bit space so the thank you will be like visible uh the space is somewhere there so i'm just trying to leave a little bit space 
that will do. Uh, the next thing, um, there's the next thing, right? Well, I'm gonna uh, stamp the sentiment, and I need a scrap of um, Usper White. I'm using the Thoughtful Thoughts um, stamp set, and I'm gonna use the Thank You. And I'm gonna use also that sentiment which say not only for your thoughtful gift but also for the wonderful gift of knowing you. Okay, and I'm gonna stamp um, uh, with basic black. I'm gonna first stamp the um, only, not only for you. And I'm gonna stamp the thank you. Just a tear. Perfect. Um, I think the black is yes. That's all. We're not gonna use any black. And I'm gonna punch with the decorative decorative label. Sentiment like so, and I'm taking um, a whisk sponge and the smoky slate, and it's just sponge around to give a little bit dimensionals. Dimension, dimension, dimensionals. I'm gonna use uh, next. <laughs> Just a quick sponge. That will do. Okay. And yeah, I'm not gonna use anymore. Um I stick the uh, label here, uh, but I'm just use the snell adhesive. Um Like so, and I'm gonna use um glimmer paper. Yes, I think is that. I'm gonna and I'm using the sweetheart punch, and I'm gonna punch one heart. Okay, and I'm also use um the scrap whisper white and I'm gonna punch another one heart just a white and I need again I forget I need again uh, my smoke slate you can punch the um heart from smoky slate uh, cardstock but I just prefer punch from the whisper white and this just to uh, use the sponge double sponge to uh, give it a little bit gray color don't have to be perfect I look better okay Now definitely I'm not gonna use anymore. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put them together um, that way. Okay, just turn and I'm gonna put dimensionals where they are there. <laughs> I'm gonna put one in the middle to hold them together. I'm gonna put one here and one here and yeah I think it's enough. Peel off the paper and the stick. Oops. 
herbs. Just gain. And just put extra. Yeah. Okay. And now we need to punch the hole uh, for the bottle. We need one inch um, a punch and we need to uh, punch, um, you need to leave about uh, one quarter uh, inch from the um, side. Uh, if, you, if, if you're scared to do it, you just can uh, take a piece of paper, you can punch, oops, no. Not like that. <laughs> okay, you can punch the circle. Uh, you can put a little bit adhesive. Okay. And put like so, so you will be sure this is on the middle. Put your punch and just punch again. And where's my bottle? There's my bottle. So that can go easy on the bottle. Oh, you know, guys, I forgot something. I uh, using the uh, Project Life um, the corner punch, and I need to punch the corners. Nice that way. Four corners. Make this look better. You don't have to do it if you don't want to. It's absolutely up to you. Yeah. Okay. And that is the bottom. And that is the tag. And take it off now. And I show my old tags again. That is what we made today. That is what I made yesterday. That one I use a botanical garden um, um, frame list. Frame list dies. I use their um, uh, new. Um, what's it called? Um, come on, guys. <laughs> Woo! Two seconds. I have. I have it there. I use embossing folder. <laughs> I use the embossing folder, uh, which this new one is gonna be available um, from the first of June. That one I use the old punch. That one I use uh, love and affection uh, from new catalog. And that I use a doll, dollies and uh, a punch, two inch punch, and I use some uh, uh, lion thread and white uh, ink and the craft, um, craft paper. Uh, yeah, all the informa information you can find in my blog, which is koshiamakinonblogspot.com and if you want to see any of the different tags, how I made it, just please leave a comment. Um, so I will try to do uh, another one tutorial maybe next week, if I have a time. Hope so. And if you enjoyed this video, please uh, be sure you give me a thumbs up and definitely subscribe my YouTube channel. And if you're interested of any product that I use uh, in this video, uh, click the link below for 24 by 7 online shopping as well as link to my blog. Thank you very much. Bye!